G'day, g'day, nice couple down the front there, looking all romantic. How old are you, mate? 27. 27? Yes. You're 27. All right. I'm going to tell you about the olden days, okay? You ready? <laughs> 27, yeah? Okay, this is how we used to take photos, right? We used to get our cameras and we'll do this. <laughs> That's called winding on. <laughs> you wouldn't have heard of that, okay? And then we'll take a photo, which was a rare event. Like our relatives were over, you know, it was an exciting time. None of this, oh, that's a nice breakfast. Pop, none of that shit. <laughs> and then we'll take a photo, right? We'll take a photo. And then this bit's going to knock your head off, right? Then we'll take the camera to the chemist. <laughs> I don't know why the pharmacist was in charge of the photos, but he was. <laughs> I don't know what he did at university. He studied painkillers, suppositories and photography, but he was in charge of the photos. And then we'll get the photos back after three weeks! And we thought, fair enough, because it was the olden days. Some of the photos would be good, some of them would be shit, but we didn't care. It was exciting. It was like photo lotto, you know? <laughs> be going through them. Oh, look, we've got a winner. Look at this beauty. Look at that one. I don't even remember taking that photo. Look at that one. We had instant photo places. We used to get our photos back within 24 hours, and we're like, Pfft. that is instantaneous. <laughs> you mean to tell me that if I give you my camera now, I'll get my photos back this time tomorrow? Pfft. That's almost quicker than dry cleaning. <laughs> you probably remember when they had a blanket over their head and Pfft. I don't, I don't remember that shit, old man. I don't. You and your sepia tone photos of the gold rush or whatever shit you've got. I don't, I don't remember any of that shit, old man. <laughs> I don't like digital cameras because they, they've got two flashes. The first flash doesn't need to be there. That's just there to stuff you up. You know, you're like, smile. You go, that was a good photo. That's the photo. <laughs> Everyone's got to check the photo. They've got to check it. They want to editorialise your ass. You take a photo, and they're like, can I have a look? And you're like, no. Who do you think you are, a pharmacist? <laughs> you haven't been to university. <laughs> you always give in, don't you? You go, OK, I'll show you the photo. I'll show you. And you go, there you go, have a look. And they always say the same thing, don't they? Can you take another photo? Because I look shit in that one. <laughs> and I'm like, if you think you look shit there, that means you look shit right there. <laughs> See that? That is what you look like, okay? <laughs> you only see that once or twice a day when you're brushing your teeth in the mirror or in a reflection of a shop window. I have to put up with that shit all day. That's a high definition megapixel version of your shit situation. That's got better resolution than your mirror. So if you want a better photo, get a better head. <laughs> Take your head to the pharmacist and get back to me when it's developed. I'm done. Enjoy your festival, bitches!